Hi Pisces, welcome back to my channel, Karma Fox. I am doing your weekly reading for the final week of September 2021. I hope everybody's doing really well. I do want to take just a quick second to remind everyone that this is a general reading and it may not resonate with everyone. If you find it's not resonating with you, I do encourage you to check your other signs and placements and see if those readings might resonate a little bit better. And if you would like a private reading, the directions are in the box beneath this video. Keep in mind in a general reading that the energies can reverse or flip-flop. Um, that's not at all unusual. And also timelines can vary. So let's go ahead and start, Pisces. Spirit, can I have the energy of Pisces? Energy of Pisces. Pisces. All right, so we start with the hangman in reverse. We have the king of wands. And we have the page of wands in the reverse. Okay, so Pisces, I feel like um, after a very long time, you have a change of perspective on a subject here. And I feel like you're keeping this to yourself. Um, there's somebody or something that you're not talking about or to, um, but you do want to take action. There's a need to take action here. Um, now, you might be in a leadership position here with this King of Wands energy. This is the energy of someone who um, is kind of a go-getter. It's somebody who... Um, you know, might be in a, might be a business owner, you might be a business owner or in a, might be a boss, um, but somebody in a position of leadership. So there is a situation here and it do also denotes action, but there, there's something here that you're wanting to take action on. Um, and I feel like there's something you're seeing very clearly now, but it took a long time to get there. Your, your perspective on whatever this is has dramatically changed. Um, it might be about somebody, and if it is, it's somebody that you're not currently talking with. But if it's about a situation, you're keeping this to yourself. Let me, let me look and see who you're connecting with. Who's Pisces connecting with? You have the Queen of Coins in reverse. Might be dealing with an Earth sign. That would be a Virgo, Taurus, or Capricorn. Keep in mind that the um, Queen and King of Pentacles are my committed couple in the Tarot. We also have the Page of Cups. We have more water, um, so it could be a water sign such as yourself, um, another Pisces, or a um, Scorpio or Cancer. All right, um, Knight of Coins in reverse. So, the person that you're dealing with, um, they could be somebody that you have had a commitment with in the past. Um, if that's the case, you are no longer in a commitment with this person or this person um, may have, they may be coming out of another commitment. Um, this could be someone who is divorced. Um, and the reason I say that is because um, this could be a divorced person that has a child. Um, Queen of Coins in the reverse is generally somebody who's divorced or, you know, they're, they're coming out of a commitment. So this might, and Page of Cups can be a child. This might be, um, this might be a single mother. Hmm. Um, if that's not the case, um, this is somebody, though, that has recently um recently come out of a commitment whether with you or with someone else um with the page of cups here that is um a very small extension of love an expression of love could be an expression of apology as well 
Knight of Coins indicates to me that this person is feeling stuck, however. They're feeling very stuck in their life right now. Let's look at the energy of this connection. This could also be a new connection. But I'm not really seeing that on your side. Palace of Wands reversed. Okay. So, if this if this is someone you work with, um, there is a lack of um, just a lack of passion within this this connection. At a very base level, there's a lack of passion at this uh, in this connection. Whether you work with this person or you live with this person, um, there's just a lack of, uh, you know, a lack of passion. Um, what is directly affecting this connection? What is directly affecting this connection? So seeds have been planted. There's a patience that's taking place here. Someone's being very patient, waiting to see what's going to happen. So um, there may have been seeds planted and somebody has now stepped back. There's something to do with loyalty here as well. But somebody has stepped back and they're just kind of waiting to see, waiting to see what's going to happen. And that's what's directly affecting this. Um, what is the outcome at the end of the week? the tower in reverse so avoiding a big shake up the energy of a tower but it may be avoided underlying energy we have the nine of cups in the reverse so somebody here is not getting what they want um, their wishes are not being fulfilled, and that's underlying energy here. Somebody's not getting what it is that they want. So let's, um, and that's, that must be why we have this, uh, Palace of Wands as the connective energy. So let's, let's see what we have here. Um, we'll clarify. Why is the hangman in reverse for Pisces? Why is the hangman in reverse for Pisces? All right, so we have the Five of Wands, the Three of Coins, the Emperor, and there's that Tower in Reverse again. Interesting. Okay, so there, if this is in the workplace, there's conflict in the workplace. Um, the Emperor would be the boss, and the boss is trying to, um, whoever's in charge is trying to avoid a problem so there's there's conflict in the workplace whoever's in charge and I feel like that would be you Pisces is trying to avoid there being a big problem and it's taken a long time but you're you're viewing this differently than you did before um, and that's what's going to help you to avoid this problem now if it's not about the workplace I just see um, that there's conflict in the um, in this the stability of this connection here, um, and there needs to be there's an attempt here. There's an attempt here to bring in a cooperative energy. So whereas you may have been you may have. Um, been in conflict with this person I, I I feel like now you're beginning to feel that you understand the need to bring in a more cooperative um, spirit to this this situation and I feel like 
Pisces, you're going to take charge of this in order to avoid this tower, this uh, this big shakeup. You're looking at it differently, this conflict. You're looking at this conflict differently, and you're going to create a, a cooper cooperation here. You're going to take charge of it, create this cooperation in order to avoid this, this huge upset. Um, why is the King of Wands here? Why is the King of Wands here? Um, Aries energy, by the way, as well as um, we have water energy. So another Pisces um, like yourself or could be um, Cancer or Scorpio. All right, so we have King of Cups and the Three of Wands. So there's definitely love here. And I feel like you've had your eye on this person and you're the one that's waiting, Pisces. You've had your eye on this person there's love here and you've been waiting. You're waiting for something here. You're waiting to see um, what's gonna happen. So that's what's affecting this connection. It's this waiting energy, waiting to see what happens here. What If things are gonna come through the way you want them to. Hmm. I do feel like you're taking action though on something. That might be the seeds that have been planted. Why is the Page of Wands in reverse? Okay. All right, we have the Hermit. And we have the Five of Coins in the reverse. So this may be somebody that you are, you are in separation from, Pisces. Because I feel like you're not talking with this person. Um, the hermit, Virgo energy, by the way, the hermit is somebody who has kind of moved away from the connection, gone within, not really communicating. Um, and they're, they're looking for answers, looking for answers for what, well, how to reunite. So not, not talking, not giving information, page of wands in reverse. So there's two cards here of not talking, but I feel like you're still keeping an eye on this person and you're kind of waiting. Um, there's a, an air of waiting to take action, waiting to, you know, bring in, the, take charge of this and, and end the conflict by bringing in cooperation. Maybe even picking up the pieces after a tower moment has already happened. Let's look at their energy. Why is the Queen of Coins here? in reverse. Why is the Queen of Coins here in reverse? It's almost like you are an onlooker to something. Uh, like you're a, you're looking on to something else, Pisces. Okay, so four of, wa four of Wands reverse, the Strength card in reverse. So there's, there's a, a marriage that is ending, and this person has fears about that. They, they have fears about ending this marriage. There's a marriage ending, Queen of Coins reversed, um, Four of Wands reversed. They're becoming single. There's, they're insecure about it. Um, there's fears around this. Why is the Page of Cups here? Blocking, Eight of... Eight of uh, Wands, Temperance in Reverse. So the love that they have, um, or a new, like an apology, or a, a, a very small um, like token, it, this has been blocked. It's been blocked. Hmm. They're unbalanced right now. Emotionally, they're unbalanced. There's a need for them to heal. And that's what's blocking them from extending emotions. 
from giving emotions. They need to heal. And so there's a, there's even communication is blocked here. Yeah, communication is blocked. And I, I feel like it's because this person is very unbalanced. They, um, there might be a sense of impatience as well. Why is the Knight of Coins in reverse? Seven of Wands and the Death card. Yeah, they're going to stand their ground about this ending. They feel stuck right now. They feel like they're they're having to battle. They're 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 having to stand their ground against a lot of problems with regard to this ending. Um, and they feel stuck. Like they they just can't get past this you know this battle right now. Like they've got so many problems with regard to this ending. And so this, this uh, new love, this new feeling of love, it, that's what's being blocked. But it's being blocked as, so they can heal as well. There, there's an impatience to move towards that. But this person is going through a lot. So I feel like, Pisces, you're looking on. You're an onlooker. You're watching this person go through a divorce. And they're standing their ground. It's not an easy separation or divorce. And right now they're stuck in the process. Why is the Palace of Wands in reverse? King of Swords reversed. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius energy. We have Scorpio out. We have Sagittarius, Leo. Um, the moon, Cancer energy. Okay, so there's the energy of someone being angry. And I feel like um, that's going to that's gonna be revealed. That's going to come out. And that's what's affecting um, the. That's what's affecting the passion within this household. So there's no passion in this household um, right now. But there, there's some anger. Someone is angry. Someone is angry because something has been revealed. There's. There's something about a, a secret coming out or someone has just realized that someone else is very angry. But it doesn't feel like it's you, Pisces, although it's coming out on your side. Yeah, because I, I don't feel like you're really angry. You might be realizing someone else is angry. Somebody might be angry about you. Um, why is the, why is the seven of coins here? Why is the seven of coins? There's definitely somebody angry. Um, and there's a realization of it, or there's something that has come out that's made someone angry. Why is the seven of coins here? We have the lovers, page of cups reversed. So you may feel that this person is a soulmate. You may have, that may be what you're waiting for. You may be waiting because you feel this person is a soulmate, but this person is not offering emotion right now. Um, you may have said to this person or given this person, you know, a choice. There might be a choice here. But right now this person is not is not opening up. They're not offering emotion right now. And I feel like you're waiting, Pisces. I feel like you're waiting for this person to offer love, to open up. What is this tower in reverse? 
only have three for the outcome. Ace of Cups reversed. Seven of Swords reversed. Ten of Coins reversed. So you're you're trying to avoid. There's going to be a tower. Now, it might be that it might be that this tower is coming, and the energy is all queuing up. So if that's the case, this is this is what's going to happen. If that's the case, oh boy. If that's the case, there's going to be seven of swords. There's going to be a mm, some kind of a I feel like lying, cheating, stealing. That's that's what the Seven of Swords is. That would be third party type energy, which would mean that you would act on your feelings with this person. Um, which that the person, in other words, everything would be in the upright for that to happen. There would be third party energy with the Seven of Swords, which would be a brand new beginning between you and this person. That's the third party energy, but this person would still be in a long standing connection. And then a tower moment would occur, which would shake everything to the ground. So I feel like that's what you're trying to avoid. That's what this person's trying to avoid. It's like there's a lot of undercurrents going on here. And you're trying to avoid that. And I feel like this person's blocking you. They're trying to avoid that. Um, and if that's not the case, I feel like um, the energy is queued up for a new beginning, but it will not take place. In order to avoid the tower moment, it won't take place until something is revealed. Because we know something is being revealed that's going to make... It's going to make someone else very angry. So there's some kind of deception that's going to be revealed that will end this connection. And that's, um, that's why this new beginning is on hold. And that that's going to prevent the tower moment because there won't be third party energy in that, in that instance. So you'll have to take it as it applies, Pisces. Um, I see two timelines there. Some of you guys are going to go for it, and some of you guys are going to hold back, and there will be something that is going to be revealed, and it's some kind of deception. You're going to find out about it, though, Pisces. You'll be the one who discovers it, and it's going to somehow end this. Um, it's going to somehow end this connection. It's a long-standing connection for this other person. And avoiding this tower moment um, by holding off on this new beginning. Bottom of the deck, we do have the Six of Cups. So this is somebody you have known before, which we do have the um, reunion card here as well. So I feel like you've known this person, you've been involved with this person before, you want to come back together with this person. I don't feel like you're currently talking with this person, but you're waiting and you're you're keeping an eye on them. Um, so let's get some tea leaf cards and see what's going on there and see if that gives us any further information. So for you Pisces, we have Elephant. A long journey, either physical or mental, will leave you wiser in the end. Interesting. And it does look like a long journey because we see with the hangman in the reverse, There's, it's been a very long journey. For the person you're connected with, we have not. Unsuccessful plans. 
So something this person is planning is not going to work out the way they think it is. And for the connection itself, we have apple. Oh boy. Temptation will test you. And there is definitely temptation that is on the board here. So, all right. Well, good luck, Pisces. Um, drop me a line. Let me know what's going on here. I, I read all of your comments. So, until I see you um, in the monthlies, um, be sure you subscribe to the channel. Like I said, drop me a comment and also like and share the video. Namaste.